In newly released audio from back in 2005, Donald Trump was caught on a hot mic while waiting to appear on a soap opera. Now, a little spoiler alert for you before we roll this. When he doesn't know he's being recorded, it gets really weird. Let's listen. And she used to be great. She's still very beautiful. I moved on her, actually. You know, she was down on Palm Beach. I moved on her, and I failed. I'll admit it. Whoa. I did try and fuck her. She was married. <laughs> huge news there. No, no, Nancy. Yeah. No, this was... And I moved on her very heavily. In fact, I took her out furniture shopping. She wanted to get some furniture. I said, I'll show you where they have some nice furniture. <laughs> I took her out furniture. I moved on her like a bitch. But I couldn't get there. And she was married. And all of a sudden, I see her. She's now got the big phony tits and everything. She's totally changed her look. She's your girl's hot as shit in the purple. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> yes, the Donald has scored. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, my man. Just, wait, wait. You got to look at me when you get out of your life. Just remember this up. Just that is remember. very you Give me the thumbs up. Okay, you are a piece. You got to put the thumbs up. <laughs> you got to okay. get the thumbs up. Okay. Can't be too happy. Can you get first? Yeah, let me. It's very funny. You got to give me the thumbs up. Uh, you and I will walk there. Oh my god. Maybe it's a different one. Better not be the publicist. No, it's, it's her. It's her. Yeah, that's her, with the gold. I better use some Tic Tacs just in case I start kissing her. You know, I'm automatically attracted to beautiful. I just start kissing them. It's like a magnet. You just kiss. I don't even wait. And when you're a star, they let you do it. You can do anything. Whatever you want. Grab them by the pussy. I could do anything. Look at those legs. All I can see is the legs. No, it looks good. Come on, Shorty. Oh, nice legs, huh? Oof, get out of the way, honey. That's good legs. Go ahead. It's always good if you don't fall out of the bus. Like Ford, Gerald Ford, remember? <laughs> Down below. Pull the hell. Hello, how are you? Hi. Hi, Mr. Trump, how nice are you? Nice seeing you. Terrific. Nice to meet you. Terrific. You know Billy Bush? How Hello, are you? nice to see you. How are you doing, Ariane? I'm doing very well, thank you. Are you ready to be a soap star? We're ready. Let's go. Make right. me a soap star. How about a little hug for the Donald? You just got off the bus. Like okay, hug, absolutely. <laughs> Melania said this was okay. I just got off the bus. Oh, <laughs> bushy, bushy. There we go. There we go. Excellent. Well, Come you've on. got a nice co star here. Good. Yes, absolutely. After you. Come That's ab. Wow. Context, he had gotten married to Melania a couple of months earlier, apparently. So he is married at that point. Yeah. F newly married to yeah. a beautiful woman. Okay, so uh, when wow. I first started uh, hearing this, in the beginning I was like, okay, the dude's cheesy, uh, but it's it hasn't gone over the top yet. I was like, maybe I even pardon him. Like, So I move on him heavy. Mm, that's not... It sounds weird. It's, it's, it sounds super weird. It's such a Donald thing to say. But I okay, but that's he's aggressive, I guess, before he was met, whatever, right? I buy them furniture. Oh, that's like to me that sounds super sad. But like, okay, he can buy them furniture, he can do that. I guess that's a move. That's a heavy move, right? Maybe literally. Then he gets to I act without asking, basically. I don't even wait. I don't wait, I just kiss them. It's like a magnet. It's yeah. No, no, there's no magnet. You're the one acting, right? Now, I don't know what the other side of that equation is. It's decent of him to ask for Tic Tacs, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and he's getting ready. I mean, because he, he, he moves right away, right. right? And obviously, the line about I, I grab him by the pussy. And then I'm like, okay, no, no, we've crossed the line here, okay? We found the line and we clearly, clearly crossed it. And then to me, I know this is going to sound weird, but maybe the most disturbing part. Was when they got off the bus. Yeah, because it's a lot of guy talk. Yeah. Okay, and Billy Bush being as pathetic as a human can be. It, it, totally. The Donald has scored. I want you to like me. Yeah, hug him. It, hug the Donald. No, no, oh. that's it. When they got off, it went from the natural flow of that conversation. They're talking about the hot girls and stuff. And you see a hot girl, you want to talk about it. I get it. Guys are guys, right? But then they're like, hug the Donald. Hug the Donald, right? And then hug me. And I was like. Oh, if I had just seen them getting off the bus, I think it's no big deal. They just got a hug. What's come on, calm down, right? Mm -hmm. But when you see the flow of the conversation, you're like, oh, this is what they do, right? And uh, hey, the Donald is here. Come mm -hmm. on, give him a hug. And he's ready. He's got the Tic Tacs in, and he's ready to make whatever cheesy move he's going to make. Now, of course, they're not going to do it on tape once the cameras are rolling and they're off the bus. But God knows what happens later and how many times he's yeah. grabbed them by the pussy. Which, by the way, I've been in locker rooms and fraternity houses. I've been to Jenks house. I've, <laughs> I, I, I've never ever heard anyone say that 
thing that he I said. Don't even you know, know what that, I don't even know what, is, what that means. What is it's, that? It's, it's just it's he sounds bizarre. like like people people are saying it sounds like uh, in Forty Year Old Virgin when he's like, yeah, I grabbed her boobs and they felt like bags of sand. <laughs> it's like you sort of heard guy talk, but right. you don't really know what it is. Yeah, you want your older brother to come and say, no, no, Don, you don't. You don't do that. Yeah, you don't move well, on them heavy. What is that even yeah. supposed to be? Right. It, and it's in just, fact, I, the most awkward line is, I moved on her like a bitch. <laughs> no, you got it reversed. Right. You're right, it's 40 year old virgin. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, th there's so many things. The, the buying furniture routine, like, I, I never even heard of that one. I don't know if that one ever actually worked. But, the right. but there's no, like, and, and I'm the same way. I've been around locker rooms, hang around ball players, hang around guys. Who women do throw themselves at? If you've yeah. been around pro athletes, that's mm -hmm. a group where there are women who are just like, yeah, I'm here. Right. Even they don't. Yeah, so I grab them by the pussy. Like nobody leads with that. No. You know, <laughs> there, there's nowhere. There's nowhere in society where that's not illegal and wrong. Where yeah, well, you know, I grab. You know, you might grab them by the hair or or what. But I grab them by the pussy. No, you never. You know, it, I I I mean, and the other thing is. You're on a bus that says Access Hollywood on the side. You mm. know there's a microphone yeah. on that bus. You know what yeah. I mean? Like that's one situation well, that's where a, yeah. you know they're recording what yeah. you, that the whole premise of the show you imagine Billy is Bush to catch you know? people. The sound guy must hate say, Billy Bush. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You yeah. know, that's <laughs> well, we've but seen that happen before. We have. We like have Chris have. Matthews, I believe. For sure. It's clearly sabotage. This is about Donald Trump, and obviously we're judging him as President potentially of the United States, which I'm convinced and always have been that he never will be. But Bill, let's just give 23 seconds to Billy Bush. The guy's got to lose his job, right? I mean, he's oh, yeah. done, right? Who knows? I mean, th that's pretty yeah. incriminating stuff you, for your national personally. host on on an entertainment show. No, I mean, oh yeah, I mean, he was he was totally going along with all playing of it. it up. I mean, yeah. sort of feeding. No, you know what I got out of that? You're Michael? gonna trust him I, I to see... interact with women. Like like what he was doing with the woman right. who was just there trying to do her job. Yeah. Yeah. No, I I hear you guys, and and maybe that'll happen. And they're a lot more risk averse than apparently the American people. The American people are like right. maybe we gamble the fate of the, the planet on that guy on Trump. Yeah. <laughs> right. But probably Access Hollywood would be like it's too much of a risk. Well, to that keep would Billy be Bush. ironic, right? That he right. becomes president, but Billy Bush loses his job. <laughs> <laughs> totally possible. Totally he just possible. Takes down one Bush after another. Right. Well, no, would, but it would be interesting though if, and I said I tweeted this earlier, so I'm kind of proud of it. But if in the end. A Bush is what takes down Donald Trump. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and so, but to me, what I got out of it most was Billy Bush being so solicitous, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, and that's how they are. That's how they get the interviews. That's how they get the access. Uh, and yeah. Uh, oh yeah, Donald, here comes the Donald. I was like, oh, you're uh, so pathetic, right? Yeah. right? I was yeah. waiting for him to say, and here's the bus driver. Why don't you give him a hug? Too? Right. Just, yeah. you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, and then and then, oh, I hope she's not the publicist. You know, yeah. even the ugly what stuff she mean? was saying about yeah. the get out of the way, shorty. Yeah. There must have been like. A, I wish know. that these guys would run into truly strong women. And when I mean, yeah. strong, I mean like physically, like a UFC fighter woman <laughs> who Ronda literally Rousey. would just deck yeah. them and be like, grab my pussy now, get up. Yeah. Get, you know what I mean? That would be so cool to. Yeah. Watch because they, their view of women is so you know skewed, so wrong. Just to have a woman come at yeah. them in their way, yeah. come at them exactly the way they come yeah. at you know go at a woman. Yeah. Well, I but, wish we had a hot mic when he encounters Melania later today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not going to. By the um, way, if Billy Bush does get fired, he's going to say they're, kick, they're kicking me out. They're kicking, they're kicking me <laughs> out. <Yeah. laughs> uh, so, and by the way, w look, we're having fun with this. Obviously, we realize that in comparison to the threat that Donald Trump poses in terms of his casual attitude towards the use of nuclear weapons or his willingness to default on the U.S.'s debt, those are worse things. But this is funny today, and also very telling about his personality. Uh, now, I want to give you the reactions or uh, some of the takes from women in Trump's life who are important to him. So this is earlier this year, Ivanka Trump defending her father, saying, look, I'm not in every interaction my father has, but he's not a groper. It's not who he is. And I've known my father, obviously, my whole life, and he has total respect for women. He's not a groper, but he will grab him by the pussy. He so, will do that. No, but that's a total conservative mentality. If it doesn't happen to me, it doesn't happen, yeah. right? But he gropes <laughs> her, too. We've seen that. Yeah, he did. He yeah. did an ass Daughters are not immune. We know that obviously Hillary Clinton immediately responded, this is horrific, we cannot allow this man to become president. Uh, Tim Kaine desperately wishes he could have added this to the things he tried to make uh, Mike Pence answer for at the last uh, VP debate. Uh, so he tweeted about that. 
Uh, also, by the way, so this became huge news on social media. It took over media. About 45 minutes go by, and I decided to see how is the right wing responding to this. And so I, uh, I typed in, I went to foxnews.com and saw this. The yellow is highlighted every instance of Trump. You'll see that not even in the tiny little we're going to hide it section do they even mention this. This is 45 minutes to an hour after the story broke. Uh, I don't have the pictures, but I did the same thing for Drudge. No reference whatsoever. Breitbart, no reference whatsoever. So it didn't <laughs> Doesn't happen. exist. Right. Doesn't happen. happen. Not the biggest uh, and, scandal and of the day. And how about the evangelical voters, right? How did they keep excusing themselves for supporting uh, this guy. No, I know why. Because let's be real about evangelical voters, right? Uh, they, they're, if I'm being kind and say that they're not hateful, which would be pretty kind, they at least function on fear and fear alone. So fear of the others, the gays, the Mexicans, the Muslims, the blacks, anyone who isn't like me, right? It has nothing to do with their so-called values. Because anytime somebody violates their so-called values and they're a Republican, but they hate the same or are fearful of the same people, Muslims, Mexicans, etc. They're like, yeah, no, no problem, no problem. Well, that's Jesus Christ, you know, is all about you know redemption, isn't he? Yeah, right? Yeah. And he found so, God. So Scott DeJarlet, uh, three abortions, Republican congressman from Tennessee. Uh, he two of them are with uh, his wife, one with a mistress. And he's reelected twice since then, by the yeah. way. Yeah. As a as a family values conservative. David Vitter uh, had sex with multiple prostitutes, uh, one that he has confessed to. Uh, to, oh no, but then he, he found the Lord Jesus Christ right afterwards, right? So that is all, that's all, all right, right? Now, whenever it's a Republican, it's totally okay. It's fine, right. It's Henry, what about Henry okay. Hyde? Henry Hyde, who, who headed the House Impeachment Committee, right, mm -hmm. had another family. He had, they found out after he had a whole other family. That's how much he values. He them. thought that right. Bill Clinton was so right. That's right. Was Double so the bad. Goes. Was so bad because of what he did with Monica Lewinsky that we cannot have this moral, uh, you know, uh, assault on America. Henry Hyde was hiding, hiding literally a family. Yeah. So but Gingrich also, and by the way, Gingrich and Livingston, two huge Republicans at the time. Having affairs while investigating Clinton's affair, yep. but they're all right. Yeah, Gingrich almost won the last time around. Big Trump supporter this time. Giuliani giant affair, very public in New York. Now criticizing Hillary Clinton for the affair her husband had. There is no end to their hypocrisy. They're also not big fans of women, you yeah. know. So, so when you have this woman, this uh, beautiful Hollywood actress being groped or whatever, you know, she's kind of asking for it. By mm -hmm. standing there looking beautiful and showing her legs. Like that that's also <laughs> right. part of it that these women, you know, they lead you astray. Like he 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 was on the bus trying to be a good Christian and then she just stood there like a throwing magnet. it at him. Like a magnet. Yep. Like it a all magnet. comes out so of the wall. You can't, it's so you can't true. blame him don't for Don't like that. women. The, the hurricane. <laughs> they don't like black people. So Haiti, you know, enough that that's somebody else's problem. Yeah. It, it just keeps coming up and coming up in different ways all the time. It's a, there's a consistency to the hypocrisy. Yeah. yeah, and so now when you throw that in their face, as is happening today in social media, well, the right wing reaction is, well, Clinton did it too. Yeah, but you guys impeached them for that. And so now you want to turn around and go, it's no big deal. It's no big deal. We should elect Trump anyway. Make him president. Make him president. Yeah. It's the exact opposite of what you said about Clinton. It's Get him away from being president. Right. He's so immoral.